Hello everybody, welcome back to more Undermine Other Mind the streaking time. We have nothing to spend our crystals on. So we're just gonna go right in. What a world, what a world. It's interesting. I mean we got like a oh. <laughs> Okay, well I'm definitely not gonna take galoshes when I I know for a fact I'll never be able to get lava walkers. That's a hard pass from me. As far as what else to go for here, I kind of feel like we actually have not done a Thunderbird run recently. Uh, Weird run start, a little bit more in stable, stable concoction than I would probably normally desire. But oh well, let's pop on down. Oh, here we go. Not the best of starts, not the worst of starts. I think that maybe the getting rid of Plague right away, I, loyalty's very good, a very good start. But I think getting rid of Plague right away will save us a lot of HP over the course of the run if we, you know, like, if we can't manage to get rid of it in time, it'd be pretty terrible. Due to the fact that uh, not only does it make it so, yes, you can sometimes I uh, take damage from your food. You also sometimes straight up just take poison damage in addition. Uh, or you heal less, yeah, you heal less from your food always, and sometimes it even poisons you, which, you know, that, that'll add up over the course of the run for sure, for sure, for sure, for sure. So getting rid of it immediately sounds like a good call. But huge shout out, Halo Davis, thank you very much. Supporting on Patreon, getting your name on a peasant here. New Gamester, Supreme Tier, Champion, Legend, Hero, Master. I s stunk there. Oh, we have the Fire Crystal, so I kind of just wanted to uh, to run and get it done like that there. Not smart. Be a little more patient here. Be a little, just a little more patient. All right. Chance at avoiding death. I'm actually going to re-roll that. Very happy I did. Guidance guidance on a run that's like a little more focused on throw is super salad. Super salad. Excuse me, sir. Super salad. Would you like super salad with your dinner? That's what I kind of... Reminds me <laughs> what I did right there. We could have cooked that. That's the thing that we also should have thought about. We can cook all of our food. So we didn't necessarily need to remove the curse. But... I'm happy I did. We would still receive less, no matter what. Even, even if it's cooked, I'm pretty sure you get quite a bit less. Pretty sure. Not positive, pretty sure. Pop it. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I'm actually going to also do something really quick. Okay. Minimizing. All right. Apologies. Apologies. Don't really want to do any extra HP stuff there. No thank you, no thank you. We don't have like, we don't have none. Like we, we started with triple HP upgrades, which is really, really solid, but it's just not that big of a deal. I don't need to go for that stuff right now. Bip bop, but I don't stop. Okay. I was, <laughs> I was trying very hard. I was doing a good job of, of avoiding them stinkers for a while there. One of the rare scenarios where I actually think I will go for a little bit of throw range because we do have, uh, we have ricochet. We really just, we can stand super far away from enemies, be completely safe, and just let the bounce and do the job. We don't need to like, it doesn't matter as much if it takes a long time for it to come back to us. Like, I want throw speed, of course, in addition to it. Which is cleaver. Don't mind if I do. Food from enemies. Why not? Speaking of why not, let's see. What do you got? Random blessing for a bomb. Seems like a... Yeah, it's a really good trade. Really good trade. Nothing we have is worth selling, and we're, we're kind of moving at a pretty quick pace here. I'm... Not necessarily trying to speed run here, but not not that this is a speed run pace, but it's a pretty it's a pretty fast pace considering we're not 
literally trying to go quickly. I think we can get something better than crit damage based off of... I, you know what? I'll take this uh, this stack of nothing. Literally pick, just picked up nothing. I don't know why the game let me do it. It held it above my hands. Empty. All right. Ooh. Oh, thank you, Zap Bird. Thank you, Zap Bird. Genuinely, I don't think that it would be too OP if uh, the Firebird and the Zap Bird at rank... Hell, it could be at rank three. Like, but if they made it so you're actually just straight up immune it to their uh, their element, it feels like it would make sense to me. I don't know. Am I crazy? At least am I crazy for that reason? Okay. I know we could cook it. There's gonna be a lot of times where we could cook food that I'm just gonna not bother for the most part. If we're this close to full at the very least, I'm probably not gonna bother that much. Adjust my chair. Adjust the chair. Yeah. All right. Pop on over to the left. Pop on over to the left. Nope, I don't really feel like doing it. I did see the gold in the corner though. Okay. Thank you. Should have left that. Oh, fine. This was a good call. Lesson learned. Less than loined. Eh, very good. Yes, it reduces our Omega Law chance. Oh, well. Getting some, uh, a little bit of throw distance and a lot of throw speed is going to be very, very fun. With Ricochet, it'll let us bounce between a lot of enemies from a very, very safe place distance and the sp ah, oh you really you really I was hoping it would bounce to the other one ricochet with them stinkers is uh it's a real treat and by that I mean I hate it throw damage yes meet sure key sure key sure Just don't want to be out of keys, you know? You never want to be out of keys. That's when things get real frustrating, you know? I do like this. And I also, I don't really love where we're at right now for strength, so I'm actually going to go for it. We going in. Yeah. Our crits are decent. Yeah, I'm glad we went for the extra strength up here. Considering this is a double stack of, uh, of throw damage and crit up, I'm really, really pleased we did it. Because getting Ponzu out of the way, it's, it's quite nice. He's probably the most frustrating of the... Wow, this is actually good RNG on a throw run. That's really good RNG on the throw run. And the fact that that took so long to go down, really neat. Whoop. Clean. Clean and easy. Clean and easy. Cook the fish. Beautiful. Why are we floating? You can use secret item that we totally don't have to cheese that fight sometimes. Uh, enemies explode after a crit. I'm actually gonna go with Golden Delicious. It actually feels like it's been a little bit since we've had it. Swing speed down, sure, why not? Sure, why not? Ugh. Got a little bit of our corner here. It was a pretty, pretty decent pace for the first three floors there. If you, if we extrapolated that data irresponsibly, then we would be at, it'd be, oh, I guess it'd be like 
a little bit under a 40 minute run. I guess that's not that crazy. It's not that fast. I think we paced it down a little bit near the end there. Whoop. It'd be, I, I think it could be a fun game to speed run. Like, just to, it's more like, uh, for me, a lot of times with quote unquote speed run, I'm more like, you know, sure. It'd be fun to play this game with the intent of beating your own personal bests uh, and stuff like that. I I don't know, ro roguelike speedruns are a tough sell for me. Because there's so much, there's so much RNG and there's always a correct, you know, like an RNG setup that is the best. You know what I'm saying? Like, it would be ideal if this happened, and you have no control over it, and you could, like, just restart 20 times until your first item room contains XYZ, you know? First, until your first item room contains the map, or whatever, you know? That doesn't sound fun at all, but, like, if, it's, it's weird, because it's, like, a lot of times roguelike runs, uh, typically are only done with like seated runs because there's like a little bit of extra mystery or like grand scale thing where it's like a, a speed run where you have to win with every single uh character in binding of isaac on random seeds because like over the course of uh this is a little weird but i'm gonna do it because it's very expensive but like over the course of that many runs the law large number will dictate that RNG across, you know, whatever, at least like five, five runs, you'd have to have pretty crazy RNG, which, you know, does uh, kind of go against what I was literally saying in the in the past here, like not preferring RNG, but you know, a lot of large numbers, it's very statistically improbable that you're going to get the perfect run that many times in a row. And I like that, like, but you're not restarting. Like, for example, you know, if we needed to do five runs in a row of Undermine and get the map the map in the first room, or first item room every single time, you know, it's just, it's not going to happen. And even if it does, you know, like, maybe you'd, maybe you'd blow that run anyways. Oh, these guys. But it's like, you probably need, I don't know, especially if it's base game un Undermine. I feel like I care. I care even less. Because <laughs> it's like, ooh. Because it's like you can start with certain items, you know? Ooh. Let's go in debt. Let's go in debt. You can start with certain items by buying them before you even get in the run. You can just keep refreshing until you get... I don't know. Like... <laughs> I... I Maybe like a, um, what would be perfect? Besides the map. I think like a, um, like a really good Ambrosia start. Because like you could dupe, you would literally have, um, you'd immediately have six blessings of a single type in the base mode immediately. I would imagine that that's probably an idea. Like that would be your potion. You would have maybe like the map to start out with or just a really, really good, really, really good item to go, okay. To go with the crazy amount of blessings. I don't know, there's a, there's a lot to it. Maybe even like, especially if you're doing like Undermine Zero, sorry, I'm just theory crafting runs that I'm never gonna do. Uh, even if you, hmm. If you're on like low, low, low levels, I was really hoping that would do. You could maybe even one-shot things, which is nuts, but you could one-shot things and literally you could maybe, maybe you'd be better off just getting a stack of like six stinking swing size up so you just clear the room, you know? There's just like, it's a cool idea. It's interesting to theory craft what the best run would be to me in theory on paper. But the act of literally just restarting until you see it. And then hoping you don't choke on the run. I don't know. I, I'm i probably not going to be the guy to uh, to sit down and do that part of it. Like, I'd watch it. 
but only if, you know, I didn't have to sit down and... <laughs> Ooh, sure. But only if I didn't have to sit down and watch all the refreshes. Personally, that that's where I'm at with, with speedrunning. It's the same sort of thing with Enter the Gungeon. It just doesn't do it for me. Doesn't do it for me. It's just uh, fun fundamentally the way certain roguelikes are laid out. Like, Mining of Isaac is almost a little, you know, it's a little bit better because of the seeded runs. Because it's like, once you found a seed that you're like, oh, I'm certain this is the one. But even then, I don't know. Usually, it's going to be like a very either super crazy OP run or a super uh, non-confrontational run, which, I don't know. Not my favorite. My favorite speed runs are finite games with, you know, maybe like a couple sections of spicy RNG. But like, they're, you can save like a very small percentage of time. But for the most part, I don't know. I, li I like a, like a good old fashioned Mario based speed run. Mario based. Or something like that. I've, I've watched a decent amount of like Mario Sunshine speedruns, stuff like that. Luigi's Mansion. Should have done that first. Hwa! Hwa! Mm, how much is this? 100. Okay. Well, I'm gonna get Aura. I don't know how good it is anymore. We need to, uh, we need to figure it out yet. And here's some curses. Oh my God, that's bad. Why would I want it? All three of those options. Like, yes, maybe we could get some value out of the gain, pick up gold gain, gain damage. Tent is, fine, but, like, we got a notorious little, uh, goof gaff about it. So, you know, tis with tis there. Bum, 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 bum. Do not like having, uh, Thunderbird in here. Not that, Thunderbird isn't why the electricity is happening. That's, uh, that's our crystal. As long as we stay out of the crystal, it's a pretty decent uh, water pool layout right now. We feel like we can actually, oh my god, actually stay in a pretty good spot. Boom, 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 boom. Clean and easy. Clean and easy. I'm liking the run. I'm liking the run. It's nice, clean, simple. Not overly ridiculous or anything. Nutritious like. Definitely going for the throw speed. This is the tough choice. I hate Tenderfoot. It's not really that bad, but I hate it just for like, just for quality of life. I do not like the feeling of not, not being able to jump freely. It does bother me. So I'm going to say nah there. I hate what it's going to do to us, but hopefully we can just remove the curse soon here. Not quite what I was hoping for. Is our swing better nowadays? Oh. Dunk him. Dunk him. No. Oh. Dunk him, dunk him. Dunk him and chunk him. Yeah, it was a pretty sloggy room here. Pretty sloggy room. I would love to remove this curse so bad. Holy guacamole. It's early enough. Two shrines when we see shrines, which is going to be quite nice when we have 108 beads healing when we use our shrines. However, it, yeah, it's not in effect yet. So we see this one over here, but... Tis not going to be duped. Happy we got this crystal as well. Because we just don't have very much damage. Pretty bad damage. Yeah, we're very much on a uh, 
a hybrid run right now. Never look back. I love that we basically have a not free, but near free usage of the shrines. Nearly headless, Nick. Oh no. Oh no. Thank you. Gems don't matter that much, but I'm gonna get them anyway. If you see me leaving gems, it's probably like, it's not on purpose, but it's more just like, I'm putting them out of my brain because I don't, they don't really, they don't really matter right now. We need to get to 99, 999 someday, but we need to unlock the final item before that's relevant anyways. Because as soon as, as soon as you hit 999, uh, the blue chests stop showing up. Which is a benefit because they get, they turn into other chests, I believe. I could be wrong. They may be replaced with literally nothing. Because if they are replaced with literally nothing, then it is a downgrade. Because things like uh, spare ordnance or uh, meat from chests, that kind of stuff. Loses a little bit of value. So I guess I don't know exactly how it works out, but I imagine that they get replaced with normal chests. I like this item. And I will tell you that I like it every time. I'm going to leave that. What up? We could do our swing throw combo like a little bit if we have a, a specific target we think should be ditched. That is scary stuff. Our damage is mediocre, though. If we could get something like a Salamander's Tail, uh, I would even take the Zap. You know, I would really like the Zap item, actually. Because we get the bonus benefit of doing extra electric damage. The orb. I would even take the, uh, totally take the Mortar's Orb. Blip, blap, final step. No. There's a rank three. Now the lightning does uh, bounce to more enemies. So that helps. Oh, what a fun thing to leave here. Um, Aura's actually really, I was gonna, I was considering leaving Aura. Speaking of aura, do we have? We do have aura. If it's it's on, I mean, we have the buff. Let's utilize that. Get rid of this. Okay. All right, clean run, nice run. Ooh. so late it's so late in the run oh my goodness no it's not worth it we're basically on other mine nine if we had like a full heal potion in our pocket or if there's one here i'll think about it here's what i'll do Here's what I'll do. I will try. Oh my god, will I try? Try all the time. Oh, we don't get to use it twice. I'm thinking, I was thinking of the wrong thing. I tried. You can't say I didn't try. I'm not super interested in going for it, unless we literally got, like, a, a full heal potion. Antimatter was a good start. But antimatter alone, I don't really feel like it. It's just, it's because it's so late in the run. It is just too late. Catalyst. We got, an, like, amazing sustain right now. Look. 
Look, 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 look! Beautiful! Okay. So let's see how our damage chocks up against these fools now. Fight me, punk. Look, he's got moves. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I don't know why I'm doing this. It's literally, there's no point. I just like the sound. I like the sound of buying stuff in this game. It's just a really satisfying reg register effect. Pow! Pow! Give me the gold, boy. Free my soul. <laughs> One of those wasn't even on the, the grate like it's supposed to be. The heck, man! Honestly, Thunderbird is doing roughly as much damage as we are, and that's sad. Alright. Point. And we get value out of that for sure. We have, uh, we have the other one. We have crit damage and the crit chance now. Go. We get our double shrine. I'm very excited about it because I definitely feel like we have not popped off in power yet. No way, Jose. I would not say that is the truth. Do we have Aura? We got Aura still. I'll take a minor curse. Sure. Sure. I, what say I do? Oh, no, thank you. I will remove my curse. Oh, come on, man. Really? Where's my damage stuff? We are really lacking. We are really lacking for strength here. think we're on a bomb run but like I will take it gives us extra money I suppose it gives us 50 right yep I just realized that uh, didn't we have debt in the last episode that we didn't pay off or did we get it paid off by the end did is it changed because I feel like I thought that it was supposed to stay oh well Do, 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 Alright. Easy enough. Easy enough. Leaves us with a Seer or Nori final boss, which is... Not gonna lie less than my favorite but it's okay we'll make it work speen yep yep good we have enough bombs and we have enough bomb generation for me to be okay with that especially since our damage just it's not great it's really not it's not bad the swing throw combo kind of is the great equalizing damage source here helps us out quite a bit since there's not uh, enemies to bounce to if you kill the ads so it's basically oh we were totally in range for that this should be moida 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 mm, beautiful all right.
You know, I just am not too pleased about either of those. Secret rooms are more secret, fine. What's our crit chance? 12%. You know, it's gonna have to be good enough. It's gonna have to be good enough. Aura. Aura. I mean, that's a secret room up there, but... Whatever. Use the bomb to kill a bomb. Aura, do we have it? We do not have Aura up. Confirmed. We can get it up for... Uh, now? <laughs> Hold on. Context. We can get it... Available. Here. We can get it available here. We'll have our buff. Give me damage. <laughs> All right, if there's not damage or maybe throw speed. I'm going to go with crit, actually. I'm going to go with crit. I'm, I would like to get extra value out of our, um, out of our daggers. Phantom knives, you know. Mediocre at best, but that's okay. These are really just like super duper health pockets. Alright. Just throw back throw out a bunch of bombs. Throw out the bombs, boys, and free my soul. I don't want to try cause that's my goal and I'll drift away. Oh, petrified rock gives us extra items from breaking rocks. Uh, it makes it way more frequent that we get items from breaking rocks rather. And it's really good. It's really good on a run where we have golden powder and we're going to be buying a crazy amount of bombs and we have spare ordnance. It's just all in all, this is... Uh, this is some hot stuff. I mean, like, you know, just look at, just, just look at our money and everything. You know, you know, you already know. Oh, this is not a lot of space to play around with unless you have item which shall not be named. Ah, standing by the wall seems like a pretty decent trick for those guys. They have aura? They do not have aura. I do not want to get a major curse then. No, thank you. I don't have bombs for that. And it would be worth it, too. But I don't know if I... Like, now I'm going to have to backtrack. This is going to be a whole... It's going to be a whole spiel. Woo, baby. Woo, baby. All right. Toughest reroll of my life. We can't get fork and. Okay, there we go. We can't get fork and our ricochet. I should probably go for fork, but we don't have any of the weird little gimmicky big benefits out of it. That we sometimes get. There is no bombs for sale. Are you yanking my chain? Please don't yank my chain in such a way. Yeah. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> yeah. Almost done here. Got the summonable, the summonable snowman. That was highly spiced. I cannot believe that that even worked a little bit. Arguable that it even did. OK, 
Okay. Was looking for sparkles, but we don't have any bombs anyways. We're done, son. Don't be friends, son. No seeds in the bundle. You happen to drive through order, but two got a green board. I'm not like my shoe. Mm, we do have the money for this, and we do have the bomb chest item. Show me what you got now. I don't really care. I just want three bombs now. Okay, well, I would have preferred, like, a little more. I'm probably not going to take the reroll item. I just... Because that one does reroll based on... Ooh. That's a... It's an HP reroll item. And not a gold reroll item, which we could really, really utilize. This damage. This damage. No! Oh, that was close. Not that it probably will matter. Yeah, it's not like that big of a deal. Yeah. All right. Next. Okay, there we go. When them crits start flying, it's way better. I mean, that got us to double our crit chance. Like, that little, little itty bitty room right there. As long as we keep our movement going, we can still keep it up at 100. We gotta make sure we're moving. Yeah. We're at plus 50. Keep it moving, keep it moving, keep it moving. Never mind. I don't care. Don't care enough. I know we don't need to jump over that. I just feel like it. Go, 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 go. Maybe we do care enough. Maybe we do care enough. Maybe we can get it. Run! Wow! It's my uh, Toad from... Specifically from Mario Party 2 impression. Wow! Not right now. Go while we have the crits. No, not right now. There's not enemies in here, and I knew there wouldn't be. I don't know what I was thinking. It's fine. Oh, well. Spice. Oh, boy. Might as well. Might as well be walking on. Come on, where's my, where's my items? Come on, pet rock. Come on, pet rock. I know you got it in you. You should definitely buy some stuff. Mm. It's just free money. I'll take a little bit of crit, just to, because during the boss fight, we're going to have zero crit when we start, and that should help us. That Just that little itty bitty extra start should help us, you know, increase, increase it faster. But we also have the crit potion, so never mind. I'm a, I'm a silly, silly boy. Should go get that bomb, but we're kind of very much in a nothing really matters territory, because this run is so strong outside of the um like it, it's we're kind of medium strong in damage with our crits and everything but more in reality it's kind of just like the the meta stuff today like the oops like the consumables and everything and the easy regeneration like easy super max out regeneration it's that's keeping us a going a big time. No, no.
All right. taking so much damage just like just cuz just cuz we can uh, uh, uh. cool Duke would have been really handy but I totally get it I don't deserve it I do not deserve it we're gonna heal so much just from all of this oh my god oh my god oh i'm so glad oh you know what the daggers the fan of knives wow what just happened there the fan of knives is absolutely beautiful are you kidding me none of this is like fun I'm, i want fun stuff very little throw damage blessings this whole run here. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Far too kind. You're far too kind. You got got. Did that... Mr. Sword hit me? I guess Mr. Sword hit me, huh? Kind of trying to spam my throw as best as I can. We can actually just do this. It doesn't matter. Wow! And we put it out immediately. What a what a bad potion! <laughs> what a bad potion! I don't like. I don't know. I don't get why it. I don't. I just don't get why it's in the game to be real like just to wow to be honest it just doesn't even seem like it should be here ah but of course also this is sure to produce a very large boost to our monet keyblade i don't even want it don't even look at me keyblade these are free. Free money. Not that that even matters. We are on the final floor. Bibbid bobbid boop. All right. That damage is. It's. It only went up just. I. Uh, I got absolutely stun locked. I couldn't actually move. I. Uh, I don't care enough. Don't care enough. Why would I, right? Doesn't matter. Can't touch me. Bam, bam, da, boop. Ba, doop, ba, doop. This is gonna heal me. She's a beaut. You already know. All right, we're fine. We're fine. We're done. I think we pop on down. We, I guess, we just antimatter like ASA pronto. We don't need to, but I, I don't think we... I don't think it's going to matter either way. Having the crit potion with everything for now is going to be very handy. Just trying to get... Okay, I was going to say trying to get my, uh, my crits stacked up here. But they already are. Are we still a throw run? Or are we a hybrid run? We sure as heck are a hybrid run. Doesn't take a lot for the run to uh, sway back in the favor of uh, of a swing. Why why were we doing it before? Oh, that's right. That's right. Yeah. Oh, that was not correct. And we are totally fine. Thanks. Next. We will get the gems, even though they don't matter a ton. But there we go. There she blows. We are going on in. 
to our chest where we are on. That's right, we don't get a crown anymore. God, that's so scary. You're like, why don't I get a crown? This game's glitch. No, it's like, I think that, uh, so 35. Do we not get another crown until 40? I don't know when we get the next crown, but that is going to do it for today. I greatly appreciate any and all support you wish to leave on the series up to this point with an extra special thank you to Halo Davis for supporting on Patreon at the Gamester Supreme tier. Thank you very much. Link at the top of the description if you want to help out the channel. There's all kinds of different tiers that will help out at whatever value you're comfortable with. Turn on uh, ad block, donate a buck. Easy peasy. Thank you for watching. Thank you, thank you. Subscribe for Roguelike some more every single day, and I will see you next time. Bye.